and welcome back. So today's video is going to be a pre-summer holiday haul video for you all. I don't normally do hauls like this, I normally do hauls after I've been away on a trip, but I bought quite a few new things to bring with me. On the trip that I am on right now, you will notice that I'm in a hotel room in the background. I'm actually in LA right now, but I've also been to Vegas and to Santa Barbara so far, and then I'm heading to VidCon tomorrow. So basically, I want to show you a few things that I bought in preparation for this trip, but also for the rest of summer as well. So it's kind of like a pre-summer holiday haul, and there will definitely be another haul video coming next week as well of things that I bought on this trip, because I bought a few things already, and I definitely will buy a few more before I leave. So keep your eyes peeled for that as well. But I'm gonna show you a few things that I bought in preparation for this trip. And first off, I have some sunglasses to show you. I actually have three pairs of sunglasses. And no, I do not have a crazy sunglasses shopping addiction. I'm actually really excited this month because I've partnered with Sunglass Hut for a few different things throughout the month. You'll find out more in a little while. But basically, they invited me to choose three different styles of sunglasses from their selection to complement my outfits for the summer. And I was really excited by this because I love changing my sunglasses. Let me tell you this now. I always have different styles on for different outfits and I love the fact that you can kind of change the vibe of an outfit with your sunglasses. I feel like a lot of people get used to the fact like wearing just one pair of sunglasses when realistically they're such an important accessory because they are on your face. It's like the first thing that people see. Anyway, so I picked out three styles that I'm really excited to wear and I have been wearing them a little bit this week already. So the first pair are from Ray-Ban and they're actually a pair of aviators. Aviators are by far one of my all-time favourite sunglasses styles because I just really like the way they look on my personal face shape. I feel like they're a, like they either suit you or they don't. And I think with Ray-Bans you're either like a wayfarer or an aviator kind of person if you get what I mean. But I love aviators and I actually have a few different styles. But the ones that I picked up this time were these ones. And these I love because they're slightly bigger than my other ones. And they have the gold frame with the plain black lenses. They actually have a slight kind of like ombre lens. Um, and I really, really like the fact that they have the... Um, I don't even know what this is called, but like the bigger bit over the bridge there. They're like a bit more of a classic looking aviator. And then they have this little circle bit in the middle. So I think they're just going to be really, really good for outfits actually like I'm wearing today. So quite boho outfits, more kind of casual, um, summer kind of beachy vibe outfits. I love these. And they're just the easiest, most lightweight sunglasses to wear as well. That's another reason why if you are if you have like a small bag or whatever, Ray-Ban aviators are like my favourite thing for that because they're so lightweight and easy to wear. The next ones that I picked up were more of a like fashion-y inspired choice and they're from Prada. I've had my sun my sunglasses, I've had my eyes on these sunglasses for ages. I've seen loads of fashion bloggers wear them actually and I always, always looked at them but I never found a colour combination that I quite liked because they usually have them in black or a lot of the times they have them in black and it's a bit harsh so I actually got them in a kind of tortoiseshell version of the originals and they are these ones. They have like the um, tortoiseshell kind of plastic frame but then they also have this Safiano leather insert on the front as well and then they have the Prada logo on the side and the bit that I love the most is the metal bridge like the double metal bridge and they are quite statement like they really are quite statement but I love them and I think for more like slightly more edgy outfits and more kind of like fashion-y events and I don't know <laughs> like fashion events for more kind of stylish outfits and things like that I think these are gonna be really good I've been loving wearing these I've worn these loads this week actually already and then the final pair that I picked up are from Burberry and these are more of a girly style and I actually have these sunglasses in a different colorway already I have them in the tortoiseshell and you guys always comment on them on Instagram and I picked them up in this amazing like blue green color and I absolutely love them I think the shape is really girly they have like a slight cat eye to them and what I really love about them is the um, metal lace kind of detail bit on the side so I think these would be nicer with like girly summery dresses and things like that so I'm super super happy with those and I already know that I love these because I do have them in a different colour so I'm super lucky that Sunglass Hut let me pick those three out and I'm also really excited I can actually offer you guys £20 off if you want to order anything from the Sunglass Hut website um, I'll put a code in the info bar below where you can do that and I'm also holding a meet up with them this week so excited or next week because this video is going up on Sunday it's going to be at the Sunglass Hut on Oxford Street on Thursday the 30th of June at 6pm 
going to have drinks and canapes, there's going to be discounts if you want to do some shopping whilst you're there and you can come and meet me and chat and have photos so if you want to come and hang out at my meetup at Sunglass Hut that would be totally awesome um, and yeah I'll put all of the info below for you guys that you can if you are thinking about coming so you can just kind of screenshot it or whatever so yeah I hope to see some of you there. So the next things I have to show you are mainly from ASOS, the first thing is this gorgeous silk maxi dress and I actually bought this for Elle's wedding. If you guys didn't see my Instagram this weekend, if you don't follow me on Instagram, I'll put a link below, but I posted a picture wearing this and so many of you are asking where it's from. I love it as well. I just think it's the most beautiful print and it's a really unusual dress as well because it's almost like a dungaree style um, front and then it's sideless. So I had to wear like a thick lace bandeau bra under this so that it was not kind of too booby. And then on the back, it has these beautiful kind of um, tails. I don't, I don't really want to call them tails, but has these like strips of the material running down all, almost to the floor, and then the sides tie at the waist. I'm actually going to do um, a different kind of insert for this video, and I'm trying it out something new that I wanted to do for you guys to put like more outfit of the day type close-ups for haul videos. Let me know if you like it or not in the comments so um, I know whether to do it again or not, but I'm going to do that so you guys can see in more detail what that looks like. But I really loved wearing it. It was so comfortable and it wasn't too expensive either. I think it was around, don't quote me on this, I think it was around £45. The next dress that I got was an absolute bargain. This is from Boohoo but via ASOS and I love this. It reminds me of um, like Santorini. I've never been to Santorini but it reminds me of all the pictures that I see of Santorini from every other blogger has been to Santorini this year, I swear, like everyone is going, it's crazy. Um, but it's just all white and blue, I love the embroidered detail and little lace bits. It's actually a very, very high neck and then it has a scalloping down the side which is quite unusual and I really like it. I've worn this a couple of times on this trip already and people have stopped me every time and asked where it's from and it was £18, absolute bargain, it's just a really easy throw on dress for the summer, it's really comfortable and yeah I really like that a lot. The next one I got is a denim dress, I'm slightly obsessed with denim dresses, I have too many of them but what I don't have already is a wrap dress um, in denim and that is what I picked up, it looks like this, it's from ASOS's own brand. Um, it's a very, very low cut one, so you, I have to be careful with like what underwear I wear with it so that I'm not flashing at anybody. Um, but yeah, it has long sleeves, which I really like, and it just has like the tie around the waist with a bow. Again, I'm going to put insert, an insert so you can see what this looks like because, I mean, you can't really with me just holding it up, but I really like that. Again, I've worn that a couple of times on my trip, and it's just very, very comfortable, easy to throw on. The next thing I picked up is a shirt. And this is from New Look, again, via ASOS, and I inadvertently ordered the tall version. I'm definitely not tall, I'm five foot three, um, but I'm quite glad I ordered the tall version, actually, because it's longer than normal, and it's a tie front shirt. And normally with these, they end up being quite cropped, but I quite like this, because I can wear it with jeans and then it's not too short. Um, it is a like nice, kind of linen-y material with a double black pinstripe, and like I said, it has the tie at the front, and yeah, just a really easy to wear, casual, kind of linen-y summer shirt that you can wear with shorts or whatever you want. I love tops like this. And then the last clothing item I picked up was this bomber jacket. I showed this in a vlog and so many of you said you liked it. I really love it too, I think it's so pretty. This is actually from Zara, and it has this beautiful navy embroidered um, leaf print all over it with silver details and I just think it's really pretty. It is quite busy so I feel like you have to wear this with something quite neutral like a white t-shirt and jeans or something like that but I just think it's really pretty. It's quite cropped and yeah just a nice kind of lightweight summer jacket which is good especially for hotter destinations that actually get a little bit chilly at night because sometimes you want to put on a jacket at night but you don't want like a full-on leather jacket or something like that so I'm really happy with that and then Finally, I have three pairs of shoes to show you guys. The first one is actually not new. I bought these a few weeks ago, but I wanted to include them because I hadn't talked about them yet and I'm obsessed with them. These are from ASOS, but they are River Island um, and they are the white lace espadrilles. These are a bit dirty because I have worn them a lot in the past few weeks. I'm going to give them a bit of a clean, but these are £18. They look really similar to the Valentino ones, which I had my eyes on, but there's no way I would spend like £400 on espadrilles because they get worn out so quickly. Like I've had these for a couple of weeks and they're already pretty worn. So, um, yeah, they look like the Valentino ones and they're £18. Bargain. So I love the white ones, but then because I love those so much, I also picked up the black version. These are a little newer, I actually haven't worn these yet, but um, I really like them. Again, I'll probably wear these more at home than I would the white ones, and the white ones more away, just because of the different kind of outfit choices. I feel like when I'm in hotter climates, I tend to wear 
like white more than black um, so yeah I really love these I think they're such a bargain I definitely recommend picking them up they're really comfy as well and then the last thing that I bought Mike's been laughing at me about these because he thinks they are ridiculous I loved them I like totally fell in love with them when I first saw them and now I'm not so sure and I can't take them back because I've already worn them once and I'm really worried about it so let me know what you guys think they're gonna be a love-hate thing and I'm I swear there's gonna be a lot of comments saying flirt you're crazy because they are kind of crazy these are from Zara and they look like this. These are my furry pom-pom sandals. What do you guys think? I think these would look so cute with like a plain beachy dress, like a white linen dress or something. I just really like them and I just threw one on the floor and it hit me on the foot and it quite hurt. Um, but I'll carry on with just the one. I really like these. I think they're so cute and colourful and carnival-esque and I think they're really fun for summer holidays. Not like for, you know, every day. I think they're really fun kind of beachy sandals and my hates them but I really like them so that's going to be it for this whole video guys I hope you enjoyed it if you did don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you again on Friday with a very special guest on my channel I will leave it at that you guys don't know who it will be but I have done a collab video which is coming on Friday so I'll see you then and I hope you all have a great day bye guys